Buckle up, it's story time. I'm gonna tell you about the possum. When I was all oh, probably about 19 years old, I was taking some community classes, some community college classes, and I was house sitting for a guy. And I come pulling in one evening, and just as I started to open the garage door, I saw a possum running by the garage, and I didn't want that possum to get in the garage, so I hit the button again to try and get the door shut. Well, he scurried in there. So I thought, oh crap, now what? Well, I grabbed my flashlight. Now back then, the flashlight to have was the three cell D cell mag light. So I grabbed this flashlight out of the door pocket of my truck. I go walking into the man door of the garage and I see this possum scurrying behind this material. And I think, now what? So I shine that flashlight around and I see this 55 gallon drum and it's full of yard implements and there's a pitchfork sticking out of there. So I walk over to that 55 gallon drum and I grab that pitchfork out of there and I go over to this material. Now this, the, the inside of this garage is unfinished so it's just two by four studs and it's got this material leaning up against this, these studs, it looks like plywood and I peek down in between the studs and I see this possum. So I take the end of my flashlight and I grab a hold of that material and I take this mag light or this pitchfork and I pull the material away from the wall and just as I pull the material I stick that possum with that pitchfork. Now in the movies that would have been done, right? But in real life if you stick a possum with a pitchfork it pisses them off and their mouths are they got they got a bunch of teeth and they get really loud and mean and they start jumping around and all of a sudden you got a pitch pitchfork full of possum and then at the same time I realized that there's this tremendous amount of weight bearing down on me and I use my flashlight and I look and I recognize that this is not plywood leaning against the wall it's pool table slate it's really heavy so I set my flashlight down and I get this possum worked out from behind this pool slate and I get it pushed back up against there and now I got this possum and he's trying to get me and I, it takes both hands to just even keep him away from me well the problem with a maglite flashlight they're a great flashlight but they're round so I try and get this flashlight and I kick it and it rolls off and it rolls underneath the car and because they're fat on one end it rolls and points away from me. And about the same time that happens, the garage door opener light shuts off, times out and shuts off. So here I am standing there in the dark with a possum on a pitchfork with a bunch of teeth. Now what? So I work my way over to that drum and I grab an axe handle and I conk this possum. Like okay, I'm in the movies be done. So I take the pitchfork and I pull it out of him and I get my flashlight out from underneath the car and I throw the axe handle down. So now I've got the flashlight in my right hand and I reach down and I grab this possum I'm going to go discard and I grab him and pick him up and just as I pick him up he wakes up. So now I've got a possum by his feet and I got the king of flashlights. In the movies that flashlight seemed like a pretty damn good club. But the problem is, when you're in the dark, if you don't turn it off before you use it as a club, you're gonna shine it right back in your eyes. And so I got this possum, and I bop him with that flashlight while I blinded myself, and I could tell that he's still alive, and so I just kept bopping him until he just quit moving. And then my flashlight wouldn't work because you're really not supposed to use them as a club. And so, and I just throw everything down. <laughs> and I walk over and I hit the switch. Y'all, that entire garage looked like a crime scene. You could see where I had mopped this bloody damn possum over here and over there and clubbed him with that. And I mean, it was a mess. So the valuable lesson that I learned, 
Mag lights suck because they roll away from you when you need them the most. You can't really use them like a club. And you damn sure ought never, ever stick a possum with a pitchfork. Have a great day.